I want to tick all these boxes. So I haven't ticked Stitch and Remnant yet. So let's tick this box. Guys, we're about to take every single box. It's going to be so damn good. All right. So the final boss is going to cleanse all units of effects which don't benefit Seraph. Does that include herself? It does, right? So she's... I can't, like, stack spell weakness on her. But... We got Offering Token, which is pretty good with Stygian. We got Molded, which is great. You can do some Reform stuff. And we got Molus Mage. So let's go for some Spell Power stuff. He's such a cutie. He's so good too, right? When you play a, your third card of the turn, draw two. Flicker's Liquor. When you play a unit, a random... Oh, man. This is tough. Guys, we got Card Draw or Flicker's Liquor for Energy. What is more important? Card Draw... So this is what Card Draw means. So I said... What Card Draw means, and then I, I walked away. So what Card Draw means is this, all right? All right, I'm going to mention two things. Hopefully, you guys are following me along. So, there's Conduit on the champion. I wish I saw if there was Conduit offered. Conduit gives me damage spells for free in the lane where that champion is. So, if we get a lot of card draw, we can play a lot of spells, right? And when we play spells, we have things like Mollus Mage making them stronger. Also, we have more cycle with offering token. Now, if we do Flicker's Liquor, we can potentially take more expensive things, and we're not pigeonholed into taking Conduit... And we can take other things on our mage, on our champion. And then we can use Flicker's Liquor to make things cheap. And the reason why we can do that is because dregs cost zero. So we can get a lot of energy off that, right? But I'm thinking if we go card draw and we focus on conduit on our champion, we can technically do a big barrage of spells quite often, right? Now, there's one thing I can mention is that with Molded, I'm probably going to be summoning a lot of zero-cost units quite often. And I'm going to be bringing my dregs back. But if I have card draw, I can do Molded more often. So I'm going to go for Wing Steel. When you play the third card, you draw two. And it's hard to play three cards, I agree. And then what we're going to do is find Conduit. Boom. And this already is so synergistic. I'm, I'm kind of Craigasming. It's so synergistic, I'm kind of Craigasming. And now we just want to go for more card draw. We can go Pip Spacer card draw. I don't think we need Ember at all. Technically. And look at that, boys. Okay, it's important to card draw because we also have two blights in the deck now, right? So we have these dead waves that need to be managed. Uh, well, that guy in the back is not going to be taken care of. That's unfortunate. But look at the damage. Look at the damage. can't get the guy in the back so we don't have targeted damage right now well, we, well, we would like targeted damage for sure we would like targeted damage we would certainly like targeted damage I just beat confident 25 now under 200 stream crap user congratulations man congratulations strong so strong already it's beautiful though strong we are already we're doing so much for reformations look at this we can get the card draw quite easily with wing still because offering tokens are a free way to do it so we're cycling through our deck so fast look how cute this is you guys seen this this deck is clean already all right that was really nice uh draw one so we can keep doing that that can help us pro activate wing still even more fast now we also can do Hilgo Crystal, which goes really well with Conduit and the spell power that I have. Uh, more reformations if you want to. Uh, extinguish so I can keep my champion alive. Yo, casting for the follow and the sub. So extinguish to keep my guys alive, like the champion. I can put him in front and then he could uh, just like, keep him alive for a little bit so I can do my spell power stuff. Yeah, this guy's pretty good. Alright, we got... When you play spells you get armor which is pretty good for the tank in the bot lane or you can do apply spell weakness now spell weakness i think we can still do a spell weakness deck so the sweep effect is very good and i think we can still do a sweep of deck um it's just that spell weakness is a little bit less good with this lady cleansing things all right so i'm gonna go for a stingy unit because you know it's a really good stingy unit guys titan sentry he's amazing 
I mean, there are some spells that I want to upgrade, but I really want to maybe get quick on Icy. So let's take a look at the shop first. Do we get quick? We got Multi Strike. That could be double. That could be double spell weakness with the sweep. Double spell weakness and st oh man, double spell weakness and some armor. I'm sorry, some strength for the sweeper. The problem is we don't have gold. We're missing gold. Uh, I don't want two of them. I would really want multi strike for double spell weakness, but then I don't have. I can't buy the. Uh, the uh, that's so unfortunate, guys. I'm I'm so close to having both. But how good would that be? Double spell weakness is pretty good. I just don't can't buy the, the strength, so that's a little unfortunate. We still need to find a tank. So at the moment, we don't only have a conventional tank, but we will get that. Now, I think if we get a tank, we get some pip space. The deck is already clean as hell. It's crazy. What's also awkward is that you kind of want to put this in a different lane because you don't want spell weakness to be on the same turn as a. Uh, like, you want this probably just to come after the fact, right? So, you want this to be the mid lane, and then... Like, it's kind of awkward, now that you think about it. Oh, uh, this is awkward. This is awkward, boys. We're, we're starting their deck like crazy, but... Okay, I want to kill that thing. I think I'd rather get the 50 gold, right? Because we're so short in gold. But I want to keep my champion alive. So I want, I want to get the 50 gold. I want to make sure I can get enough spell weakness going on, right? This guy's going to stay alive. I'm, take, I'm taking 7 power damage intentionally just so I can get... um. Well, technically, I can kill this guy as well. But I want—I want—I want to save the fire damage. So I'm gonna do this. So I'm gonna do this, and all I care about is getting some spell weakness going on on the boss, and then we're good. We're gonna have this guy as like our tank for a little bit. I'll kill this guy so that I don't take. Right, this is not bad. This is not bad. So we get a little bit of spell weakness on the boss. It's fine. What's that trick? Oh, yeah, it's common. Exactly. So now we do this. Look at this. GG. Working beautifully. Our early game strategy is working beautifully. Man, we're getting better at this game. I can feel it. Ice Tornado goes really well with the magic power on my floor and goes really good with spell weakness. This Ice Tornado is really good with the magic power that I have. Apply more spell weakness. Okay, it's. So Crypt Builder is pretty good because I can. I have two offering tokens I can play for free. But with Conduit, we're probably going to play things for free anyways, right? I don't know. So with this, is like, okay, this is good with offering tokens that I have to get more bang for my buck. But it's also kind of nice. The, the effect of pushing things to the back is kind of nice. But Ice Tornado goes really well with the magic power. Hmm. And once Conduit's leveled up, Ice, ice Tornado is going to be kind of free anyways, right? Do I just go for the offering token, or I go for? I think I go for the better spell, in my opinion. More reformations, so we can keep bringing things back, or the ability to make my my units last longer. I think hollow drippings could be useful sometimes. Yeah. What's up, uh, Willis? How you doing, buddy? Maybe it's just a skiff. Do I really? Is hollow drippings just bloat? I mean, I, I get enough card draw that I can play hollow drippings. All right, I, I think I have enough card draw to make this okay. Um, Revenge is game or Burnout. I don't... These are like... These are tanks, but these are not the tanks I want. I think I want... The Stygian tanks. A.K.A. Titan Sentry for the most part. But this is not the worst tank. Like, I put this in the bot lane. It's not the worst tank. Should I take it just now for the tank, or am I going to regret it later? Like, how perfect am I trying to get here? I think we go for the tank here. So the bot lane is a little bit more secure. Alright? And now I still want to upgrade my units. So my double sheeper has a little bit more oomph to it. Maybe I want to find quick or something. But quick with only two attack is kind of awkward. It definitely wants strength. Now, what else unit upgrade do I want? 
I probably just want to strike for the, the Icy and maybe get some more health for Lady of the House. We just want Lady of the House to be healthier. We also want Mullus Mage to have like some health as well. So he doesn't die to Thorns and he doesn't die to Sweep. Exactly, Luigi. Um, but we could also look for another tank. The Icy tank right here. And we also want to upgrade some spells, but I don't have money for anything, so... I'm gonna go over here. And I'm gonna try to find some attack for my... Whoa, we got a large stone. That's pretty good, right? Now that does 16 times 2. And that bottom lane has... That's pretty good, right? And I can give a little more health to Lady of the House with the Wickstone. I just want to get... I have to get pip space from here on out. Like, that's pretty good. Now the, now the tank lasts a little bit longer because it has more burnout. And now we just got to focus on getting pip space. So now our double sweeper is doing 16 times 2 sweeping, which is really good, and applying 2 spell weakness. So that's really good. Oh, what do we duplicate? Do we do Ice Tornado again? Because we have Conduit? Are we just going full out Ice Tornado? the conduit deck or are we trying to think like okay maybe more mages what if we put more mages so if we have like a thousand mages don't we just destroy things with spells i don't know i wonder i wonder what's the best thing here do i do more mages or do i want to have more spells like ice tornado ice tornado is not upgraded this mage could be kind of crazy right you guys want to try like a crazy mage thing and we can always reform this back and stuff we're going to have a lot of mages, though. We're going to have six Mullus mages. As opposed to, like, six tornadoes. You want a cutie mage squad? Fine. Cutie mage squad it is. Wait, what about more sweepers that give more spell weakness? And we keep stacking spell weakness. What do you guys think about that? This is a pretty strong unit. It's got sweep multi-strike. But how do, do we have enough space for all these sweep... Because we, if, so if we, we have to get, I oh know, we have to get more pip space. But if we do, we can put two mages in one lane. So that's four spell weakness. I think we do mages. I think we do this. This is, this is almost too many mages though. Fuck. Let's have some fun here. Let's have some fun. I, I want to upgrade it before though. I want to give it health because this thing is really susceptible to thorns and spikes. But maybe that's a good thing. Because now that I have so many of them, if one of them dies, well, I can replace it with, if, with his twin brother. There's a lot of good things going on here already. So, like, look, I have a, a, a large stone uh, sweeper that does double spell weakness in this lane, Lagia. And then... And then I have... Uh, I, I got six mages. The six... Let me show you. This is my tank. It's the tank for now. And then... This is going to be interesting. I think Laga is going to enjoy this one. For all the mages I have in my deck, I still haven't found them. Kind of incredible. There they are. This deck is really cool already. And that bomb is killing my tank. Oh, we, we can bring the tank back with Molded, though. Okay, but here's the thing, guys. We need something a tank for the... <laughs> we need a tank for our champion. Maybe we don't. Maybe we don't. Look, this lane's gonna be crazy. Look at this kill lane. Look at this kill lane. You guys ready? Okay, I hope that he he comes here. I'm going to do a lot of spells right now. You guys ready? I just need to play spell. I need to play cards so I could... Uh, I'm supposed to bring Lady of the House back. Fuck. Now I don't have space for her. I was supposed to bring Lady of the House back. Okay, I don't have any spells to play. Oh my god, my, I need more spells in my deck.
Alright, I need to fit Lady of the House in. We need even more card draws, that's what we need. Wait, when he gets to the top lane, he's gonna be destroyed. I need to remove all these Froge Lances. I think Froge Lances are just bad for us. Alright, so how many Soul Weakness is he going to get? He has 12 Soul Weakness. Oh my god, look at this. This is going to do... 41... 533 times 3. And this is... This is like the second fight of the game. Oh my god, Ancient Synergy. Isn't that super good? Holy shit, that's super good. That's got to be really good. Alright, should we put this as our new tank? The Revenge Frostbite, or do we not, do we not need it? Maybe we just want Lady of the House as our tank and we can keep bringing her back with Molded. So now we need Pip Space, right? Pip Space or Card Draw? Card Draw would be really good to keep doing spell stuff. Pip Space means I could do... I could fit more mages on the mid lane. And also keep my, my Lady of the House alive a little bit longer. So Pip Space basically means I could like... Yeah, have more magic power in the mid lane, but also maybe put like a tome in front of the lady if I need to, or do some stuff like that. But Cardro will be really good so I can keep playing spells. Alright, so what we need to do is remove some of these stewards, remove some of these frozen lances, and just make the deck super clean. I think we already win. So if I were to duplicate, do I duplicate Ancient Synergy? Wait, doesn't Aishinino work better with the, ma the mages? Ice Tornado works best, right? So we need to upgrade Ice Tornado. Um, but I do really want to remove. So removal, I prioritize a lot. I also want gold because I need to upgrade some spells. Artifacts could be quite good as well. I think we really want to start removing though. He's, I mean, now we have Pip Stage for the, for the stewards. It's not the worst. But I want to get to this combo ASAP, so I do want to remove. What would I duplicate then in that situation? Do I just do, do two Icy? I think at this point we do two icy. If we're gonna if we're gonna duplicate something, I probably put two icy in the in the bot lane, and then I put a lady of the house in the mid lane as a tank. So maybe she can be her own tank because look how, look how big she is. So we put two of these in the bot lane and just get a whole bunch of spell weakness. If they survive, they, then they're dead. Doesn't that make a lot of sense? She's big enough where she can like she's she's her own tank. And then we move some of these uh these train stewards. This deck is already fantastic. What's up, Sheen? How you doing? This makes a whole bunch of sense. So if they ever get past this double sweeping shenanigans, we can't fit Legion of Wax, right? Like I can put him in the top lane. I have Pip Space, right? He's a pretty good card, but the deck doesn't really care about this. He rather put the I rather put upgrades on my spells. The deck doesn't care about this, yeah. This is like a spell deck, and I think we already kind of have our direction. We want Conduit. So now he's going to make sure we can keep our champion alive in the face of Thorns and in the face of Sweep. So Sweep is going to be our biggest enemy, so what we really need is Silence. Because Sweep is our biggest enemy. And this is totally fine, because if they survive to the mid lane, well, they're going to die from spells anyways. So they're going to have trouble surviving that, right? I mean, surely. Also, guys, remind me, I should try to do this. We don't have Crypt Builder, so we actually never mind. Offer token doesn't mean anything. So this would be our tank for the mid lane. This guy has four. Oh my god, look at this. When Frozen Lance is OP. Wait, look how many Molus Mages I have. Holy shit. This, this is an insane lane. I think we do even more pip space. We put even more mages there. But again, sweep kills us. So we really need to silence to stop the sweep. And if they somehow get past this. If they somehow get past this, we put them in the... We have a mage in the top lane to kill them as well. It looks like they're getting past this. We have mages in the top lane to take care of them. What's up, Sal? How you doing, buddy? It 
So, oh my god. But this guy's gonna die, but I can always bring it back. Can I keep this thing alive? I can't, right? I did do most of the five times, yep. My frozen lance is just broken. I want to bring back Icy, but she's going to die with Burnout anyway. So my, my goal is maybe I can mold again. That's my goal. Because if, if I can bring it back one more time, that would be fantastic. Alright, this is this should be good enough though, right? This should be good enough, like He should die in the mid lane anyways, yeah? So I'm gonna play one more I wanna find a better spell. It's just frozen lenses. Frozen lenses are just okay, okay, okay. So you want to try Bart? Uh, yeah, I want to play PBE. I, I tried telling you guys it's facing PBE. And you guys ignored me. So yes, I want to try it. I'm down. We'll do it tonight. All right, we got this is a good thing. When you play three spells in a turn, you gain magic power. Nice. We need silence, right? This stops sweep. We need this badly. So yeah, this is my weakness, sure. But silence stops sweep and it stops the thing that really messes me up. So we take the silence. Um... What do you guys think about stop swimming blade? Silence does not stop sweep. What am I talking about? It stops. Wait, I, I thought I was using silence to stop sweep. What was I using silence for? Yeah, it's not trigger ability. It stops. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was using it. What was I using silence for? No, I was just dazing the guy. I was I need daze. Now nah, Bard's a League of Legends character. Alright, so something blade is I can get this strong. I can get this is targeted damage and I can get it pretty strong. Because I have so much spell power. This this has to be good, right? Because it's, it's targeted damage that I can make it really strong. I'm gonna try it out. I need to remove these frozen lances though. Yeah, I need sapper days. Yep, I need days badly. So we have more duplicates. We have gold and we can upgrade our units and get an artifact. What unit will we upgrade? We don't really care about upgrading units here. So let's take what the cavern has. So Apply endless to a unit, apply silence, apply trample. Is trample good for my sweepers? Who, who what, what if I endless on my champion so he never dies? I think and just in case put endless on my champion or something. Let me remove a lot of cards though. So what would I duplicate now? More Ancient Synergies? I mean, this is a good card. Do I need another tank? I mean, I don't have space for it, yeah? Maybe maybe I take another Endless so I can have an Endless on my Sheeper as well. I was going to do like another... Um They start with 15 armor. That's to be okay, right? I need the gold and also... Our sweepers do some good damage and our spells should kill them. I want to put endless on my guy, but... Fuck, I need more energy. It, talks too, it took too much energy to play all that stuff.
I can save my, my tank's life if I want to. I can put silence here because there's no not, not a lot of things for silence otherwise. First of all, I got the artifact that gives him one year upgrade slot. Let's go, man. Alright, we got Subsuming Blade finally. I can put it on this guy. Oh my god, it my Subsuming Blade did 100 damage targeted. Holy shit. A hundred targeted damage. Just like that. We got all our mages out of our deck. At this point, we don't really want Dregs as much. We want Endless Hunter Champion just in case he dies, right? Instant synergy here. 285 to everybody. That, that card's insane because it goes through to the next. And we're scaling as well, forgotten name. Let's put Endless on our Sweeper. Oh, at this point, it doesn't matter, right? Endless on Sweeper doesn't matter anymore. I finally I put my champion in the top lane and I finished in the top lane. So endless on the super doesn't matter anymore. I put endless on the top lane and that's it. Wait, I put champion I put endless on her, so if she dies, I, I can just make a new tank top lane and a new champion top lane and just and just, just win off that. It's easy. Like it's nuts, right? Now the boss has they has sweep, so I gotta be careful. They have sweep. GG. Woohoo! I, I only got one super blade black. I need to remove so many cards. I need to remove so many cards. Did I take another super blade? Nah, right? Do we want from this child? Nah. This deck is like it already has a, a theme. And it, and it works beautifully. So I now just gotta remove cards and we're good. So removal, removal. I do want to upgrade spells though. So what spells would I want to upgrade here? Subsuming blade maybe? That that put subsuming blade like holdover. Make that thing really big. We also want to get removed, but we don't care about the, sh the unit upgrades as much. I guess we can upgrade the Burnout. We can upgrade Lady of the House, give her some more health. Mm, we, wanna, we want to upgrade spells. Uh, I'll toss in some, some health here. We have a lot of health to give away. Hey, okay, I'll take it. That's also gold, but I'll take it. Whatever. It could be useful. You never know. Power health is a research, and we're using it. Alright. So, upgrade shots, remove, consume. What would want to be remove, consume? None of these things, right? I don't need to apply more endless, so that's not that good. Give a magic power to a spell. I just really good an ice tornado. Make a spell cost cheaper. Uh, that's pretty decent on Subsuming Blade. Oh, but it's already gonna be- yeah, just in case I don't- Because I can't always play it in the, um... Double stack. I guess this is good to keep my, my tank alive. Just make it so that it gets out of my deck. And I can make- Make it things cheaper makes it so that it's easier to play in other lanes. So, something I want to play in other lanes is maybe Subsuming Blade. I want it to always be free, even in other lanes. That might be useful, right? I guess you wanna maybe I wanna save for holdover for subsuming blade. I think holdover would be the best thing. Is it holdover? Hey, wouldn't we want holdover on something like ancient synergy or ice tornado though? We probably want holdover on these. This also goes through the units though. So like if it kills the front unit, it goes through. This is a very powerful spell. Basically, I want to make something free in the event that like molded, for instance, it doesn't get um. Molded doesn't get reduced by conduit, so let's remove that. Let's make that cheaper, I guess. 
And we don't need all these frozen lances, although it makes my... We don't need all these frozen lances. We don't need all these drags either, though. Frozen lances, I can at least, like, play them in the mid lane. Alright, we spent a lot of gold there to remove, because I didn't get to get removal. But I made the mistake last time, where I desperately needed removal, and I didn't spend money on it. So I made sure to change that. We got both our ICs, so let's go. Though, uh, they are doing some damage. Should I do this? Oh, well, I can't. Never mind. Fuck, I want to play this. That would be useful. Fuck it. Let's get that frozen inside of our deck. Actually, we're stacking spell weakness in the boss already. Subsuming blade. Boom. Boom. Get these out of our deck. Beautiful. We're scaling up everything. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I gotta put endless on my icy thing though. Like my icy guy just already died. That's pretty bad. If I do this, I can do some damage. It's not good enough. My icy tank already died. This guy has sweep. Uh, I keep forgetting this guy has sweep. Hey, guy, this guy has sweep. Whoops. Silence? Nope. Do I want to waste the spell weakness on, on the frozen lands? I want to waste for something better, right? We want to put endless on this unit. These guys are going to die. Yeah, we want to put endless on our weakest guy for sure. We want this girl to not die from burnout, so this thing has six burnout. We go ahead and do this. Let's go ahead and put endless on our champion in case it dies. Let's bring, I kind of want to bring back my icy sweeper. Maybe I can keep molding her back. I, that applies even more spell weakness to the boss. So the boss can now have a shit ton of spell weakness. Eight, to be exact. Uh, can I just do it on her? Nah, let's keep stacking this up for slay. This guy has sweep, so we gotta kill him. I wanna keep bringing back my sweeper. Maybe I can give her enough burnout eventually that she just like pops off. I guess I don't really need to care about this lane. I can let this thing die as well. Get it out of my deck. So I'm basically making my deck smaller as the fight goes on. This would be a good time to do damage though, because uh, this is going to do like one shot. I just killed the boss. Easy. Game over. Alright. Beautiful. All spells get plus magic power. Do we like that? I mean, it kind of goes well for what our deck is doing, right? If we get, we can get hold of our harness. Do we even need harness though? It's harness... Yeah, I'll take a harness. Do not we want more card draw? We want card draw, right? Because we want to keep doing harness more often. We want to make sure we draw into our combos. We want to draw into our spells. So we don't care about Pip's face number two. We just want more card draw at this point. And upgrade conduit one more time. And we just keep playing so many things and have so many options. We can go for trinkets or we can go for more removal and more upgrades. This is perfect. So I think I'd, I want to get rid of some of these frozen lances. And some of these drags, even though like Frozen Lance does help my ancient synergy, I have other spells that I care about. At this point, I, w I, I even wonder do I even care about all these mages? Now, I think our deck's complete. We don't want all these Frozen Lances though, right? Let's take a look at this cavern first. We can give a unit plus 25 life. It needs to have an upgrade slot, right? 
What is Heartless? Can that be healed? That's okay. We don't heal our units ever. So this, isn't this perfect? It keeps all our small units alive. This is perfect. This is so good. It keeps my things alive, like potentially to sweep in thorns. And this is perfect. It just keeps my, my weak stuff alive. And I never heal my units anyways, right? This is amazing. This is like a really, really, really good. Because it actually keeps like the weak stuff alive. I think it was made for something like this. Okay, what would we want holder? This is very important. Do we want holdover for ice ancient synergy or holdover for harness of titans? Maybe harness of titans constantly and I make it free? Damn, dude. Damn, this is popping off. Put another frozen lance to get out of my deck. Damn, we are popping off. One more conduit. He is heartless as well. Man. Guys, I think Stygian is so good. I think Stygian is like... Uh, it's gonna be... That's fine. We have health to lose. Stygian is... Super good. Some of these things got silence. It's pretty good. Oh, I can't play the other uh, Icy. That's awkward. That's really awkward. Hmm. We're gonna take some power damage. That's okay, though. All right, so swimming, so blade. Harness a Titan. Ah, oh, even makes my dregs nice. Man. Only thing is, we need to um. We need to bring. We need to put endless on our our tank. She really needs endless. Oh, look at this harness of Titan though. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't get to put endless on my tank. Uh, I need card draw here. So I think we try to keep our tank alive with like this, yeah. Boom! Keep your tank alive. Huge. Let's, uh, stack up burnout on our, our lady. I want the side of my deck as well. We got endless, we got endless. Okay, this is good. Super big. Dude, do I bring back my other lady? Uh, I can't, right? I want to keep this girl alive. I'll put this in front, maybe keep her alive longer. So it's important to keep my lady alive. Put some of these in the top lane. So if they ever get past, where they're gonna die over there. She has endless already. Let's put another mage up top. I wanna get some cards right here. Ah, oh, fuck. Stop swimming blade. Oh, stop swimming is getting big. Who else wants endless? Unless I'm a champion just in case. It's just in case my champion dies, then um I need to find a way to tank for this. Oh, we can tank with this. Oh, there's getting so much about weakness there. Icy tornado. Oh, I can't use it. I do so much damage in this lane. And my dregs are actually kind of powerful. This petrified heart's amazing. Oh, I silenced the boss so he doesn't get. Oh, silence just destroyed this boss. This is what I want to silence for. Silence makes this guy 
ne negligible. Wait, I think I can get the kill with Sushimine Blade. A thousand... 995. Give me that slay bonus. This deck is nuts. Another mage? We don't need another one, right? Sap and Frostbite. So Sap stops sweep. Right? I need this for sweep. This is the only way I can counter sweep. We don't care about sweep anymore because we have the Heartless, Petrified Heart, whatever, and we also have like Endless in our champions. So we don't care about sweep as much. So I'm going to skip. Remove all debuffs from friendlies and all buffs from units. We don't care about this. The deck is clean. And we're rich. Let's buy some trinkets. Oh, let's buy some trinkets. Is this the final boss? Okay, we're here, boys. Um, go for removal and duplicate. So what will we duplicate? Do we want double... Double harness? Probably not, right? We probably just want double ancient synergy, I think. Or like double... I think double ancient synergy here. And then we can maybe upgrade some units. And mainly we just want to get the trinkets. What spells do we want to upgrade? We still want to upgrade some of these spells. Like, I would like holdover on this. But what, okay, what am I removing at this point? I remove this molded. I don't care about it. Maybe. And I remove another frozen lance. Do I really want all these dregs? The dregs have been kind of useful, but I put them. I, I don't know. I'd rather just get endless on my sweepers instead. Hold over on dagger. Hold over on dagger would be nice. So yeah, we do, there are some soft upgrades we, we, we wouldn't mind. Yeah, they're good blockers if I need them. I'm going to go ahead and do this, though. I'm going to go over here. Let's take a look at the trinkets first. Let's take what this has to offer. As quick. Do I have space in my... I don't have space. But I would love to put quick on... I'm going to give Lady House more health. That's what she wants. Let's go check out the trinkets first. Oopsies. Enemies get minus one. Eh. I guess improved fireback could be okay. Because I do get some card draw. And it might be useful to have a more important turn one. But for the most part, this is whatever. This could be okay, but also it's also kind of just whatever, you know? So it might just be a reroll here. And maybe Wings Indulgence, that could help as well. Because there is a Sweeper. And Turn 1 is not that important though, right? I mean it is, but... I'll take this. Oh, whoa. That could be useful, right? I'll take that. It's more spell weakness. And if the boss goes there, it can get more, more spell weakness. Let's go ahead and remove some of these dregs. You think we should keep these frozen lances? I don't think so. I don't think we need two molded. Uh, I think I want to. I would rather duplicate ancient synergy here. But some people want to duplicate harness of Titan. It doesn't make that much sense to me. I think it's ancient synergy. And I can remove some more cards. Wait, did I want anything that has quick? Nah, I didn't. So we remove one more drag or one one frozen lance. Okay, remove one drag. Um, we'll make one of our drags beefy, I guess. All right, let's go. Everything should work beautifully. We got one of our ICs already. I want to get. End this on it, apparently. Uh, hopefully. Alright, we got Harness of Titan on one card. What does this thing is? When a unit of this bird dies, let's silence that. Let's put this here and play this. Alright. Lost some fire health already. 
We got our other guy here. We need to get endless on it. We need to get endless. I want to scale that up, I guess. Uh, I want to get this out of my deck. Alright, we scale up our magic power. We really gotta end this on our ices before they die. I'm also gonna put one less on my champion because I think that's pretty important. Oh, this is a really good uh, Harness of Titan here. This is a good Harness of Titan. Subsuming Blade, huge. I can kill the Sweeper. I didn't get to save both my Ices. Black Hearts means they can't heal. They're heartless. Alright, we got Endless on this. It's beautiful. Gorgeous. And we get to scale up all these spells. Look at these spells. Huge. Huge. We got endless on our champion as well, if it, just in case, right? And deck is pretty complete here. Let's get this guy up top. Ah, oh, but he's gonna live. It's okay. We're taking more power damage. We don't. We don't care about that. Nah, I want- she has spell weakness. I, just, I guess she removes spell weakness anyways. I wanted to actually, um, not kill it there. Intentionally. Oh, my lady's dying to burn out. Fuck. I can keep her alive with, uh, with this. I need to get- I need to keep this girl alive though, fuck. It's one of the only times to take Carlos yet because I don't really care about the. Uh... I need to bring my lady back. Where's my tank? I got hollow drippings way too late. I guess technically I could just like pile on two more mages. I guess. I need my spells now though. I keep my super alive as well, so I I can let these mages die. Oh, he has sweep. Oh, it doesn't matter. She has endless, so I don't mind if she dies, I suppose. I need to, I need to find molded again. So, my, she's gonna die. She kind of just have to be buffs, yeah, so, but I never got to get enough spell weakness on her. I can bring, I can play this one though, get some more spell weakness. I can bring both of them actually, so, but I want to bring back my tank for this lane, right? Wait, is it, is it even important to put Lady of the House for the tank this lane, or do I just want to bring back my spell weakness right now? But it's not even important to bring back the tank for this lane, right? I, I can I can bring back Lady of the House and make her last for a long time. It might be good damage. Is it is it better? Is Lady of the House better here with hollow drippings? Because this is a decent amount of damage. It might be. Or do I want to apply more spell weakness? What do you think? Maybe Lady of the House is better? Hey, where is she? Where is Lady of the House? Where is she? But where is Lady of the House? Is she not dead? 
Am I blind? Yeah, I should send this for weakness, bro. Oh, I can put another one. Wait, this is big. So wait, if I do this, how much damage do I have right now? This does. This is thirty-four times. Uh, thirty-four plus forty-three times two, right? I killed her. <laughs> I checked my consume file, she wasn't there. Alright, GG. This deck was awesome. What a boomer of a deck. I don't know where Lady of the House went, she just disappeared. That was easy mode. <laughs>